Hello everyone and welcome back to another YouTube video. I'm back with another week in my life. Today's gonna be more productive and an actual week in my life because I know the last one, my best friend was visiting me for the full week. So, my main goals this week are to get enough protein intake, take all my supplements and vitamins every morning because I have not been doing that, and go harder in the gym, and eat at home. So, let's see if we can accomplish that in this week's video. I just got ready for the gym. Here's my little work outfit. I actually am about to start selling workout outfits on my clothing brand at Real High Fashion, so I'll show you some of those in the video at some point. I have like a few things planned today. I'm gonna go get my toes done with my mom. I got my nails done yesterday i love them and then it's gonna be 70 degrees outside today so i don't know if i'm gonna go to the pool or what but i'm definitely going to be outside my voice kind of sounds weird because like today is the first day i kind of feel actually better i've been like sick a little bit so i'm feeling good it's monday we're gonna have a great week and i can't wait to take y'all along with me let's go to the gym Okay, before I head out, I just had the little frozen sausage biscuits for breakfast because I need to go to the store today, so we'll do that together. Um, I need plastic cups too, so I haven't even taken my supplements yet because um, all my dishes are done and I'm not about to use one of my cups. So I'm going to take that later today. And then I did some laundry. I have pretty much all my laundry done. So that's a great start to my week. And I threw out all my old flowers that I had in here. And today we need to buy some new ones. So now let's head to the gym. Here's the gym fit. About to take you guys through my workout. So the warm up is 15 glute bridges, 15 fire hydrants, and then 15 kickbacks. Three rounds of that, and that is the warm up. I'm losing myself. for today's workout um the videos you just watched you do three rounds of that so three rounds for the warm-up and three rounds for um the circuit my camera is about to die i'm about to charge it for a little bit but i have to run to the post office why is my nose red i have to run to the post office i have a lot of packages to drop off and go to the tanning bed so i'll see y'all after the tanning bed Okay, y'all, I went to the tanning bed. I just got to the nail salon, so we're gonna go get a pedicure and then go to the post office. I charged the battery in my car, so. I am starving, hold on. I'm like starving bad, and I'm trying not to think about it because I get really hangry, and I was just hangry. And so I started listening to country music. It feels so good outside. It's like 70 degrees. I had my windows down. I was listening to country music. I try not to think about how hungry I am. My mom told me not to get food yet because we're gonna go eat together after we get our nails done. Hi, baby. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? Thank you. Where's my mom? Oh. Hi, mommy. Say hi. I think I'm gonna get white this time because I've been doing French on my toes for a while now. I used to only do white. So I think I'm gonna go back to white, see if I like it. Cause if not, I'm just gonna switch it right before spring break. This feels amazing. Toes are done, they look perfect. The flames are catching on fire. Oh, 
no, 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 no. Told you I love you, you call me a liar. Get oh no 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 no! And praises. We just got the Cheesecake Factory. I'm so mad. I told my mom we should go to the pool after the gym, and she was like, "Okay, I don't know if it's that warm. It's the UV is five, and it's 72 degrees outside. Yeah. Like I need to be outside right now. That's why I was waiting for y'all just standing outside of my car. <laughs> oh my gosh! Holds a flame, so I'm catching a fire. I'm back. I went. To Publix and got some groceries after I ate a cheesecake. I got these because I ran out um, whenever I'm in need of like a quick little snack because I get hangry very easily. So, say I'm like on my way to dinner, but I know I'm gonna be hangry by the time the food is gonna come. Just grab a handful of these. I wanted the little pack ones, but they, the last two times I was at Publix, they didn't have it. So, I just got the bag. I got salami. Mmm. This is dangerous to open right now because then I'm gonna eat a bunch of it. I'm just gonna eat one piece. Salami with like wrapped around pickle. So yummy. I'm literally just gonna eat one piece. Mmm. I got my granola, protein granola. I got like five of these. My breakfast is usually this with strawberries and protein granola. This is 20 grams of protein. And then I got some avocados that I'm going to eat with salt because I love avocados. Then this is another little snack I like when I'm doing my homework or something on my computer and I'm in bed. Dark chocolate covered raisins. I'm going to shred that rotisserie chicken. And then my strawberries are bad, so I got more strawberries. Then for my meal prep this week, I already had the rice and the potatoes that I'm going to make. Um, but then I eat... A little piece of cornbread, which these are so good. I got some spear pickles. Throw these bad strawberries away. But these are the potatoes that I use for my meal prep. You just put them in the microwave and they're so good. And then this is the rice that I use with my meal prep. Just white rice. And it's like really like good. It tastes like buttery. It's not dry at all. And I really love that meal prep. I haven't done it in a couple weeks because I dread shredding this. Like, that's literally the like, only reason why I haven't done it. My goal is not to just, like, eat very healthy and stuff. It's more to eat in because I spend way too much money on food. And then once I get the habit down of eating in at home, then I can start focusing on what I'm consuming even though I don't think I eat like horrible I eat Chipotle like every day but that is better than eating like a Zaxby's every day you know okay now I need to do this chicken the reason why I hate it is because I have to do it right when I get home from Publix because it's like way easier to do when it's hot good little Monday reset for sure and Snoopy goes crazy about this chicken I think I'm about to take Snoopy on a walk to Piedmont Park or something maybe. It's like um, so warm outside but the sun's about to set. I'm trying to do it like before sunset. I need to hurry actually. I need to just like lay in the grass at Piedmont Park and take in this warm weather. I think I'm just going to stay in this and not put on new clothes to go on my walk. So I'm just gonna get those dirty as well. And these are my workout clothes. And I'm gonna do that instead of taking a nap because this week I'm gonna try to not nap as much. Usually I take a nap every day, but it's been really messing up my sleep schedule. Like I don't sleep good that night if I take a nap during the day. They have like pre-shredded chicken at Target. So I definitely need to get that because this shit never doing that again the only reason why it's annoying is because i don't grocery shop at target so i mean i guess i could start i just such a Publix girl i love Publix. snoopy are you excited for your walk come here look at how excited he gets when i grab the leash like he jumps so high <gasps> come here come here tries to eat it. 
No, we have to put it on your neck. Good boy. Got Snoopy. We made it to the park, guys. You can't even tell how pretty the sunset looks in the camera. I got like really foggy. I really love it here. Something about like good views, like looking at like the city. I don't know, it just makes me feel, I am such a views person. It makes me think about like life and I'm like, just sitting here like wow I'm so blessed I'm so happy I love my life and I just have so much to be thankful for so yeah me and my little park date Snoopy I've been laying here looking at the city and the view oh and I've been looking at everyone else like this family down there is with their kids and they're like setting up a picnic right now playing music so cute and then these girls in front of me are like facing each other just like talking I think they're playing a card game and then these girls over here are singing and playing the guitar it's so cute and wholesome so crazy just thinking about like everyone's separate lives I can't wait to have a family to my future kids this is mom here we're manifesting we're gonna be a little happy family going on picnics to the park when it hits 70 degrees like it did in Atlanta with my husband and my perfect children I'm so excited for that. Mommy loves you and hopefully you get to meet Snoopy too. You definitely will, right? Yeah, you definitely will. Snoopy's old self can watch this video and look at him when he's so young and curious. <laughs> but anyways, guys, my camera is about to die and I need to start walking back before it gets too dark. But I love y'all and I will see y'all when I get home. I am back home and showered and clean. About to do my little nighttime routine. Starting with washing my face with CeraVe. But I didn't really film as much as I wanted today because my camera um, kept dying. So tomorrow will be my full day today was just kind of the start of my week i got everything together i did a little homework i got home and i just did laundry and opened some amazon packages i got some stuff for my pop-up shop that is saturday i'm so excited for my pop-up y'all i would tell y'all to come if you're watching but it will have already happened by the time this is posted but make sure to follow either my instagram or my brand's instagram for future pop-ups because eventually I'm gonna try to do these like monthly just so I can like get more of a relationship with my customers and y'all will be able to meet me and hang out and yeah I feel like it's just a fun little vibe eventually I want to like travel and do them host events and stuff that is the end goal but of course for now I'm starting just in my city which is Atlanta but today was a pretty good day i was productive even though i did have a little mental breakdown at one point but it happens y'all it happens tomorrow i have a long day i have a hair appointment i have to take some packages to the post office i need to pick up my canvas with my brand's logo on it for the pop-up shop i ordered it from fedex hoping it turns out good i don't know what else i need to do i'm just like trying to make sure i have everything ready and situated for the pop-up shop i'm a little bit stressed but okay i'm back i use cerave lotion by the way and i just used this mouthwash and aquaphor on my lips and that's all for my night routine try to decide if i should cut my hair tomorrow at my appointment because i feel like it's grown a good bit since i cut it i think that's it for tonight 
curls are get get about to lay down and relax it's only 10 30 but i'm gonna try to go to sleep early because i have to wake up early and do a lot of stuff before my hair appointment and my appointment's at 12. so i'm gonna try to not scroll on my phone it's a new goal of mine is to try to not like pointless scrolling on social media so i'm gonna turn all the lights off and set my phone down and go to sleep I will see you guys in the morning for my hair appointment. I guess this is kind of like a glow up with me video as well. Because I got my nails and toes done yesterday. Hair today. But I love you guys and I'll see y'all in the morning. Good morning YouTube. It's like 10.30 right now. I was supposed to have a hair appointment. But my hair lady sadly had to cancel on me so still i'll get it done in this vlog but it will be thursday now which i'm kind of upset about but it's okay i have a lot of stuff planned that i need to get done today um so we have a little schedule going ever since my hair has been shorter i've been using claw clip Anyways, let's do my morning routine. So I'm about to walk my dog. And then I need to package like 12 orders and take them all to the post office. And then I need to get go to Trader Joe's to get my soup dumplings and some flowers. I'm gonna go to the tanning bed. I'm really mad that I didn't go to the gym today. I train with a trainer Monday through Thursday, but I thought I had a hair appointment, so I didn't go to my morning training session. One thing about me, usually if I don't work out in the morning, I'm not going to work out, which is why I love training in the morning, but it is going to be like 70 degrees again today, so I might just go on another long walk around like sunset with my puppy. I need to make my breakfast. Also, everyone should make their bed first thing they do when they wake up supposedly that is like guaranteed your day will be better oh thank you for shopping that was an order for my brand but um look how empty my place looks without flowers let's see what someone ordered period perfect timing i'm like about to package orders i'm gonna show y'all my breakfast i already fed my puppers I also didn't show y'all me taking my little supplements yesterday, so I will show y'all that today. I hate when it's like watery when I open it. So you gotta shake it up. Okay, so I do about this much water, and then I'm gonna put my L-glutamine and OxyShred. Scoop of each in that and take it like a shot. But first, let's cut up my strawberries. Okay, I'm also gonna make a little TikTok day in my life today. I haven't posted on TikTok in like six days. I literally sometimes just don't know what to post. Like, I need y'all to comment on this video and let me know what type of content y'all like. Sometimes I feel like the little day in the life swipes might be boring for some people. I don't know if y'all want y'all want talking videos. Snoopy's munching on his food. I need help with what TikTok content you guys want. I might start doing like go to Target with me and like tell y'all my Target fave, hygiene faves, but you can only make so many of those videos, you know? So yeah, that's why I haven't been as active on TikTok So I'm kind of just like, once you stop posting on TikTok, it's so hard to start again because you're like, what do I post? And you're just kind of used to like not. And I'm gonna eat breakfast and lunch at home. I'm gonna eat my meal prep for lunch. I might go get dinner with my dad or something. And I really want crumble cookie because they have good flavors. Mmm. Well, and I know that she's gonna eat it too. Got a little distracted. I was talking to my best friend, Caroline. Love her. We're on the phone for like 30 minutes, but I did take my vitamins that I want to show y'all. Vitamin C, magnesium, and turmeric are what I take. And then I took my little shot of L-glutamine and OxyShred. Good for your gut health. Next on my list is to package my orders. 
So let's start by printing out the shipping labels. Okay, you guys, I got them all packaged and put in these two bags to go to the post office. I'm about to put on some clothes because I'm still in my robe and I have to run a few errands while I'm out. I need to go to the tanning bed and Trader Joe's and the post office. So, let's go. Just got back from running my errands. I look tan. It's giving sun kissed. But I just made my meal prep. I want to show y'all. It looks very plain, but it actually has a lot of flavor. The potatoes, rotisserie chicken, and rice. I eat this little piece of cornbread, too. Also went to Trader Joe's. I got three things of flowers. I got two red roses, one white. And then I got four packs of dumplings. I'm about to fall over. I'm so hungry, so I'm going to deal with the roses after I eat. My flowers are done. They look beautiful. Just took an amazing body shower. Shaved my legs, feeling great. I'm about to get in bed right now. I think it's like four. Yes, it's 3.59. I'm about to do a little bit of homework, I think, and some work on my computer until dinner time. I'm going to eat with my dad around like 6.30. So I will see you guys when I'm out of bed. Here's the fit. My sister just got here. We are riding together to go meet my dad for dinner. I just got these white heels. I love, I think I'm gonna put a fit together tonight for my pop-up shop or at least try to so I can know if I need to go to the mall in the next couple days. But I think I wanna do like a cute classy fit instead of wearing my brand sweatpants cause I always wear them and I wanna look really cute at the pop-up. Just filled up my water because I'm getting crumble cookie later. Now let's go get in the car. Time to know you fat. Hi. Our dad probably thinks we only have one outfit because we wear the same thing every time we come eat with him. That is true. <laughs> on the hoodie. But we're at Provino's, about to eat good. We get the salad. This sounds so good right now. Yeah, it's perfect to go with the crumble. And I brought a full water for my crumble. But uh, here we all only get the salad and the rolls. Um, we eat a lot of it, but it's like perfect to go get crumble after Not yeah the crumble flavors this week are, over. are amazing i can't wait to taste test them for you guys We're overly popping it this week overly popping it <laughs> it feels so good outside it feels so good. it's like 70 degrees it feels like with wind okay pete hi it's like a different universe in this place yeah. like i hate it I feel like I just time traveled 400 years. Hello. Hello. Here's the amazing salad. We get like three of them. And the rolls are so unreal. Made it to crumble cookie. This is my favorite one and they don't have it this week. Oh, it's cold in here. How many are we getting? And we like three of them. <laughs> oh, she got six. Oh, she's getting mad. Two of those. Cornbread. We've had that, right? Oh. Another. I think I'm gonna love old fashioned donuts. Okay, let's just get two of each. <laughs> Come on, sir. Thank you. Oh, I'm so excited. Got my water on deck. Here we go. Oh! Wow. Time for the taste test that we've all been waiting for. By the time y'all see this, the flavors will be gone though, sadly. The old fashioned doesn't really smell good. It smells like the fake old fashioned. What's a fake old fashioned? Okay, ready? Cheers, old fashioned. Mm -mm. Mm. <laughs> it's 
to be warmed up in the microwave though. Okay, chocolate. Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Daddy, do you want some? No. Oh my god, that's that. Cheers. Good, I think I just still had chocolate in my mouth. 10 out of 10. Guys, I got my other sign in and they're so close to being perfect. This one's just a little smaller. But I feel like it's not that bad. My dog acts like a cat, by the way. So really cute. It'll definitely be really cute for my pop-up. But I was thinking about hanging them right there. But if they're not exact, I don't think it'll look that good. It's okay. They'll be very, very cute at the pop-up. Time to do my skincare and get ready for bed. It's 9.47. Great time to get in bed. Tomorrow, I'm going to wake up and go to the gym. And then I have to come home and get ready. Kind of in a rush. I'll do my makeup routine for you guys, though. Um, I'm going to lunch with some new friends. Um, they asked my sister if we wanted to go get lunch and have a little business meeting. Speak business, which I love to hear. Great people to surround yourself by is people who have similar mindsets. Oh, thank you for shopping. I always say that out loud when I get an um, order. But what I was saying was... As I get older, I really just want to surround myself around people who have like similar goals and interests as me. Not even similar interests, just like the same like hustle, if that makes sense. We're all trying to reach our own personal goals, if that makes sense. The people we met are great people. A lot of them actually also have clothing brands. I feel like it's just good to be around people who have similar goals as you as well because everyone can learn stuff from each other. A little behind the scenes. I have been up. It's like almost 1 a.m. But fun fact, when you're manufacturers in China, this is kind of the only time you get to talk to them because it's like a 24-hour time change. So it is 12 in the afternoon right now. So I've been up talking to my manufacturer measuring stuff for these samples that i'm trying to get i'm doing like a swimsuit shorts and tank top um set for the summer i'm trying to figure out the perfect measurement for a tank top style that i like because tank tops are weird i definitely don't like certain tank tops so mine needs to be perfect I'm trying to find in my closet see if i have one that i like love i found shorts that i love the sizing and i measured them and sent the sizing over so i'm trying to figure this out right now because i don't know if i love the tank top that i just measured on me so yeah i'm so tired but this needs to get done because i want the samples asap but i'll see you guys in the morning Good morning, YouTube. It is Wednesday morning. Getting ready for the gym right now, and I have to go to lunch after. So my hair is disgusting right now. I don't know what to do with it. I don't know what it is about the short hair, but I don't really like the messy bun with the short hair. We're gonna do a little tinted moisturizer. I just started my period this morning, and I'm cramping. So bad. Found my little earrings. Thank God. But guys, I have like this lingering stress feeling for multiple reasons. Not really my pop-up shop, but slightly my pop-up shop. This one is more of where the stress is coming from. But I have a Spanish exam, midterm exam. Here's my gym shoes, by the way. On a Friday morning at 10 a.m. And it's like a Zoom call with my teacher. And she's going to be like asking me questions in Spanish that I have to answer. So like I have to study really hard today and tomorrow. But I just have so much to do. But yeah, I'm like going to feel so much better after that 
is over Friday morning. The only thing I'm stressed about at my pop-up is the parking. Like, there's not really good parking. People are going to have to do, like, street parking, and it's on a Saturday. So I just hope that it's, like, not bad and, like, everyone can find parking easily. But everything will work out. Let's make my breakfast. My yogurt, 20 grams of protein. These strawberries are like so fresh. I'm kind of mad because I'm so sore from leg day on Monday. But then I didn't go to the gym yesterday because I thought I had a hair appointment. But Wednesday's our leg day too, so I have another leg day. But it's okay. That's what's needed. Right here is it with strawberries. And then I mix it. Oxy shred and L glutamine. It's like a wind tunnel in my place whenever my back door is open. Granola. The thing about this, I have to eat it at home because I literally add like three layers of granola. Where did it go? This is my favorite breakfast ever. I used to never eat yogurt or anything. And so when I, I think it's like an acquired taste or something, because when I first started eating it, I was eating it for the protein, and I had to like force myself to eat it. Now I love it. Okay, just finished eating my breakfast. I'm about to take my puppy on a walk, and I will see you guys at the gym. I'm losing myself. I just got home and took a shower. I'm about to do my makeup and then pick out my outfit. I think I'm just gonna wear like a casual fit. I'm on TikTok live, so if you don't follow me on TikTok, I go live often. Make sure to follow. Okay guys, I'm ready. I curled the hair. I'm loving it. I feel real cute. Let me show y'all the fit. We got this Juicy Couture sweatsuit. So cute. Louis Vuitton slides. Louis purse. Okay, I'm kind of in a hurry, so I will see you guys at lunch. We just got done with our business meeting. It went great, Perfect. great, great, great. We didn't even end up eating where we were. Um, it was straight business talk, but now we're about to, we just met them at La Paria. La Paria. So we're about to go get some Mexican food. Y'all know we love this restaurant. We yeah. be here all the time. So let's go eat, we're starving. Can you lock your car? Cause my and stuff, it's, stuff's gonna Can you lock your car is crazy. I always lock my oh, car, babe. I never do. So. Oh, not locking your car is absolutely crazy. Okay, it's raining. Bye. Yeah. I got a chicken uh, quesadilla. I am back home and I have a good bit of homework to do. So we're gonna finish that to get some work done and I will see you guys after. No gym tomorrow because I have a hair appointment at 10 a.m. So we're gonna plan out my day in a little bit, but first I... Ooh. Okay, I need to get some work done and I will see you guys in a second. Nighttime routine is complete. Just wash the face, brush the teeth, all that. We have an early morning tomorrow. It's 9.40 right now, but I'm about to study for the rest of the night. I finished my homework like a while ago, and I've been on the phone with my sister for like over an hour. I'm talking about my brand, figuring stuff out. And now it's time to study for my exam that I have Friday because I remembered tomorrow I do have to go out. Um, for my friend's like first little event thingy. He's a promoter and I have to go support my friends He's always supported me. So I do have to pop out tomorrow for him That means I'm probably going to consume some alcohol. So I need to study tonight and like all day tomorrow 
in the club, like whatever. About to study for the rest of the night, literally till I get so tired that I can't keep my eyes open. Love you guys. Good morning, everyone. I woke up really early, um, naturally at like seven, and I stayed awake for like 30 minutes because I like got on my phone. Then I went back to sleep, and you know how like when you go back to sleep, you're like more tired. So it was a struggle for me to just get up, but it's nine o'clock. I need to leave like soon. It's like 30 minutes away. So I am just going to put on a little tint of moisturizer, some concealer. My skin's been really good. I don't know if y'all peeped. So I haven't been having to do too much. I was gonna get my lashes redone before my event. But I kind of like when they're like, like I like when they're really full, but I also really like when they're like not as full. My lashes stay for so long. I'd be forgetting like when the last time I even was there. I'm mad because this is another week where my week isn't like fully normal because I usually never miss workouts unless I have to. But my hair appointment messed me up this week. But it is oh. I absolutely love my like natural look. Tint and moisturizer, concealer, and bronzer. Like something about like my cheeks being bronzed, my eyes being like really light underneath. I feel like when I do my full beat, it's not really like that because I have on foundation. But like I'm obsessed every time I do this. Finish it. I need to take my puppy out and I'm gonna walk to the bagel place right here and grab a bagel since I probably need to eat something more than just my yogurt. And then let's check the weather. Now you gotta check the weather since I live in Atlanta and yesterday was 78, but today it's 42. So I need a hoodie. Okay, here's today's fit cute and comfy. I literally wear this cropped black hoodie like every day of my life. It's my best purchase. But, and I think it was like Goodwill and I just cut it. But I'm about to take my puppy on a walk. Okay girls, I made it to my hair appointment. I got my bagel and then my hair lady said she's gonna be a little late. So I went and got a little drink. But I'm about to walk in. I will see you guys when I'm inside. Talk about my vlog. <laughs> you guys, my hair is perfect. And I cut two inches off. Ah! It's so perfect. I'm so happy. And I did a little side part. I can't believe this is my hair just blow dried. No, no flat iron. But she did amazing. I'm so happy. Okay, I'm about to go eat real quick and then meet my mom at her gym. Well, I forgot to show y'all, but I got some amazing sushi real quick. Crunchy California roll, fried California roll. Okay guys, I'm at my mom's gym. I had to pick up some inventory that I'm bringing to my pop-up shop and I needed this rack. So I need to put this in my car. My son. Oh. My mom bought my son these super cute toys. So we're gonna give him them. Which one should we do? Oh, they're hard. I feel like he'll like this one a lot. <gasps> oh, is this a toy? Is this a toy for you, boy? Oh! I got Fashion Nova and Shein haul. So let's open it up. Okay, first thing first are these jeans. They're like denim and black denim. Needed some good jeans. I only got, I really was only supposed to get this pair of jeans, but then jeans were buy one, get one free, so that's why I got that one. This pair of jeans my sister already has, and I absolutely love them. They're like the perfect black jeans. They're not like too flared, and there's like a zipper down the whole side. This is really cute. This is like for like a spring break fit, maybe like a daytime fit or a nighttime. I could really do either. 
It's the Ed Hardy dress. And it would be cute as like a little cover up, but it also would be cute with boots dressed up. So cute. I love this. I have another Shein package on the way, and I got stuff for bathing suits, swimwear type. These next two are going out dresses for spring break. This also could be a cute cover up. I don't know if y'all can really tell. What are you gonna wear under that? A white bra and white underwear or tan. This looks completely see-through as well, but I'll wear black bra and panties. Ooh, long dress. Got this. Literally, it's probably gonna tarnish after spring break, but I just got it for spring break. I don't know if it's gonna fit. A cute little Cuban anklet. Hope it fits. And then I also got this one in case it didn't fit. It's just silver. So oh, I got something else. Oh, I wanted to make sure I had an anklet. <laughs> I got another one. This is a little, these, one that one's gonna work. These were late night purchases at like 3 a.m. You know how those sometimes are a little weird. Oh, this one's cute. This little tennis. Cute. So one of those will be on my ankle on spring break. Okay, I got these because I was like, I need white slides. And I just don't know if these are so hideous. I mean, I know a lot of people wear slides like these, but it's just like, I don't know if they're so hideous. I know my mom thinks they're hideous. I just, it does look like something Nana would wear. I just knew I needed them and I saw them. I was like, oh, I have to get these, I guess. Definitely didn't, but. Yeah, those are a no. I'll go ahead and throw those in the chat. It definitely doesn't look that bad. It's just not really like my vibe. I just knew I needed something, but I'm definitely gonna either go to like Steve Madden or something and get something a little better than this. Bathing suit looks bright. This is the only bathing suit in this order. The actual swim for spring break is coming. I need that. The top. This is the bottom. I love swimsuits with these type of bottoms. This was for possibly like wearing to like a pool party or something. It's just like good white shorts, this white crop top. So, oh yeah, that's perfect for a little pool party day. Yeah, it's like I was telling my mom like, I don't just want to wear a bit because obviously some, like most of the time I'm, I'm never getting in a body of water unless I'm like planning on going to the ocean, but like for the pool parties and I just hate the like jean shorts vibe. Um, I don't remember buying this. Oh yeah, I do. Um, this is like, I love this style shirt. I think it's so classy. This is like my fourth one now. And it's just like light blue and brown. And I thought that maybe I could dress it up in Miami with the white shorts and heels. Yeah. yeah. So I had a vision. That's actually, I think, why I bought this. I didn't think that that top would end up cute. What in the world is this? This is another little classy top. You're probably not gonna be able to tell what it is now, but it's like those tops that like droop down, oh. down really low. So I thought that could be cute, maybe with like some jean shorts or something and heels or boots. I got this bandeau black um, top. I'm actually glad it's this material. I thought it was gonna be like a horrible, horrible material, but it kind of- Oh, leather. What? Yeah, it, it feels like I don't know if this will be for spring break. I just thought it was so cute. It kind of reminds me of Marnie. You, you can like zip it down and stuff. I saw a girl wear it with like jeans and it was just really, really cute. I got this jeans or dinner or uh, khaki skirt. Looks tiny, but I just wanted something other than jean shorts. I don't really know what my vision was with this shirt, but it just looks so cute on one girl in the reviews. So I decided to get it like this. It just looked so cute on this girl. Maybe I'll wear it to a pool party. We'll see how it looks on my boobies, but it was like $2. This I'm really excited for. This is actually the last thing. So this top with matching shorts. And it's gonna be really cute. That was a great purchase on my part. All this. Besides the white shoes, could have kept them. Green outfits gonna The be white cute. shoes in this, I could have gone without. But for this to be a 3 a.m. order, I really did my big one.
because usually when it's 3 a.m. I change my whole like vibe. Okay guys, that's it for the haul. I will see y'all in a little bit. Eating a little snacky and about to get in bed and relax for a second. I couldn't decide which crumble cookie I wanted, so I heated up a little bit of all of them. All right, y'all, I just did a quick little makeup look. Hair is looking beautiful. But this is my fit tonight here. Will you show them? I'm just wearing a big hoodie and my Ricks. Cozy, it's a Thursday. People are probably gonna pop it tonight. I'm not trying to pop it. On some regular On shit. some regular chill shit. And my sister looks cute as fuck. Also, it's freezing, y'all. Just two minutes ago, I was telling y'all how hot it is outside. And now it's freezing. This stuff is amazing. If you haven't watched my hygiene favorites video and shower routine video, I just posted one like two weeks ago. So go check it out. All right, y'all. Me and Red Martini. Here's the fit. Let's go take some shots. Hello, everyone. Happy Friday. Is it Friday? Yeah. Um, I woke up this morning and I had a Spanish exam that I've been so stressed about and he literally told me I got a perfect score. I'm literally like 200 pounds lifted off of me after that and I feel so relaxed. I like don't have much to do today. I went and got Chipotle for lunch. It's rainy outside, nasty outside. Don't plan on leaving. I'm gonna do work on my computer. I'm about to edit and post this video because I have to vlog tomorrow for my pop-up. I'm gonna do a whole separate video for that. I just have to do some work for my brand. Um, I have no schoolwork, thank God. And yeah, I am feeling great. Um, later tonight, I'm just gonna set everything up, make a little checklist, make sure I have everything ready for my pop-up shop tomorrow. But if you want to come to future little events I'm having, I might start doing them in different cities. I feel like that would be so fun. But make sure you're following my brand account or my main Instagram account or TikTok. Um, all the information will always be on all three of those accounts. So yeah, but I'm probably just gonna go ahead and end the video here. I hope y'all enjoyed my week in my life. It kind of was a little bit of a weird week. I didn't work out every day, so it kind of threw me off. But this is just a week in the life of Brookie. I love you guys and I will see y'all in the next video.